Hello every math study student. Here are some advice and some guidelines regarding the use of your uh, calculator at the final exam. Um, this is mine, this is how it looks. Now your uh, or the invigilators, they might reset the memory uh, before the examination starts. This goes for uh, chemistry, math, economics, physics and maybe others. They might, they might not, but you should know how to delete or clear the memory. You can't delete it. So clear the memory. This is how it is done. You press second and the plus button. Here and you access the memory. And you go down until you hit reset. And you press enter. And it says, are you sure? Yes, please reset. And now the RAM is cleared. Now the apps on your computer, oh, sorry, your calculator should still be in there. Those are the two apps that we use, Finance and the Polynomial Root Finder and Simultaneous Equation Solver. But if, say you used, or you bought your calculator used, there might be apps on your calculator that are illegal. And you should know how to delete, delete those it is your responsibility that you don't have any apps on your cal calculator that are illegal. So this is what you should do in order to check. Here I have this document. It is the official guide that is on... No, this one is not the guide. Uh, it's conduct of ID Diploma Program Examinations. So it doesn't matter where I got it from. I'll show you the list of approved apps here, list of approved apps or applications. So all these are allowed if you have that these ones on your calculator. And the ones we used are finance and the polynomial root finder and simultaneous equation solver. But all the others, they are also approved. Any other you should delete. And this is how you do it. You take your calculator and you can you access the memory. And you go one down and here is the memory management or delete. So this is, I don't know what that is short for. You hit enter and here you have a list of things that you can delete. And you go down until you hit apps. And I only have one that I can delete. So if you have I will, normally I do, don't want to delete this one. This one is approved, right? And I'll, I'm going to use this one at the final exam. But if you have one in here installed that is not on this list, you should delete it. And what you do is you press delete. And it will ask, are you sure? And let me just delete it. So it's gone. Now don't delete finance and don't delete the polynomial root finder and simultaneous equations, all the two. You need a cable and find another one, a, a student who's got it, and then you can uh, get it again. But you can find it online on YouTube how to. Uh, what I'll do is I'll just open it again and find it here. Not enough room. God darn. So let me see if I can make a new one over here and open. Now I have a new one and my apps, these are the two ones that I use. So okay, just to sum up, you can access the memory here, you should know how to reset it and clear any unwanted apps. And I urge you to do this, try it and don't do it the day before because you might need a s another student if you uh, accidentally act accidentally or deletes a, an app that was used or should be in the list. What we use is again finance and the polynomial root finder, these two. So don't delete those. Any others we don't care about. Now, so before 
the final exam there are three things that you should know is all right first you should go into mode and make sure that uh, you can change between radians and degrees you should make sure that this is set to degree if not all your trick questions will be wrong so make sure the degree is highlighted and that should be alright quit um, depending on the uh, version your user uh, interface might be different I can go down and down here I have something called stat diagnostics this one should be turned on if not when you make the regression line the correlation coefficient r squared will not be shown and you need this one to be turned on if you don't have this user interface what you should do is go into the catalog you press second and hit zero that's the catalog and you go down until you hit d for diagnostics D, uh, 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 diagnostics and we want this to be turned on I hit enter and enter again make sure that it says done then now diagnostics is turned on that was the second thing first thing was to turn degrees on second thing is to turn diagnostics on and the last thing is make sure make sure that your stat plots are turned off some of the older versions they can't both plot and make a graph at the same time I'll try to turn this one on uh, do I have something in my I think I put something in, no I didn't that was the other one I just pulled that one out this one <coughs> this one that I want to have before if I press Y equals no it's not I go into stat and edit and here I have a list let's try to make something one two three some points and eight six two and I'll try to plot that so I press second and I go now they are turned off so I cannot plot anything I'll pl turn it on and now I can graph there's you my plots but some of the older versions they can't both have plot points and a graph I'm not sure if this one is capable of that let's try to plot x squared at the same time hit graph it can actually okay this is nice for me but some of you can't can't graph if you have a plot so make sure you, you you'll never need the stat plots on your calculator if it if it if they ask you to plot things uh, make a graph and plot that uh, in the booklet or ask for graph paper so in order to turn the stat plots off you had second second and stat plots you can see this one is turned on I press enter and turn it off and now when I graph something you can see the stat plot is not there anymore to make sure that was the third thing if you press Y equals and some of these are highlighted go up and make sure that it is turned off oh I can do it from here actually I can press enter and now this is turned on turn this one on, I'll turn this one on make sure that they are all turned off go up and turn them on by make sure they are not highlighted okay to sum up, what time is it? yeah, 10 minutes memory, in the memory clear the memory delete unwanted or high, uh, apps that are illegal and that was it first two things make sure go into mode make sure that it is set to degree 
shoot, this one's not. Make turn diagnostics on. If you have this user interface, you can turn diagnostics on down here. If not, go into catalog, select, uh, scroll down until you hit D for diagnostics and find the diagnostics on and make sure it says done. And for the last thing, make sure that your plots are turned off. So no nothing is highlighted here. All right. I wish you well and break a leg at the final exam. Cheers.